Hey what's up guys it's Vimal here and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today's video is going to be super awesome because I have a brand new smartphone to show you all. Samsung has launched their brand new M series phone the Galaxy M30s and in this video we'll be unboxing and checking out how this phone looks like. It's their brand new M30s guys, S stands for super, it's like an upgrade to their previous M30 and comes with a lot of awesome upgrades which I'll tell you in this video. So as you can see right now we have two Galaxy M30s and if you are wondering why do I have two of them well samsung has actually sent one for my dad and the other one for myself if you guys don't know my dad also reviews products in telugu language i'll just leave a link to his channel in the description box below you can check it out there all right then let's get started with the video let me show you the box packing of the phone the M30s comes in this very similar box packing just like the other M series phones. You've got the Samsung M30s branding everywhere and has a picture of the phone on the front. As you can see it says that this phone only supports Indian SIM cards and going to the back we've got all the specs of this phone. Let's check them out. The phone comes with some monster specs guys like it's got a 6000 milliampere battery, has a 48 megapixel triple camera setup which is the highest ever seen on an M series phone and also comes with a beautiful super AMOLED display just like the previous Galaxy M30. It's got a new triple camera setup as I've told you just now and has a 16 megapixel camera on the front, comes with a 6.4 inch Full HD plus Super AMOLED Infinity U display and a brand new Exynos 9611 Monster Octa-Core CPU. The phone comes in two variants, 4GB and 6GB variant. The one we have right now is the 6GB RAM variant and comes with an onboard storage capacity of 128GB. Talking about the colors, this phone comes in three colors. The one we have right now is the Sapphire Blue Edition. And on the other side, we've got the pricing details. The price on the box says 18,500 rupees, but I'm not exactly sure about the pricing details because this phone was under embargo while making this video. But I believe this phone is going to be priced for the same exact pricing of the Galaxy M30 guys. Okay, we'll talk about the pricing at a later part. First, let's get started with the unboxing. Let's open the box and check out the phone. So on opening the box, we've got the Galaxy M30s at the top, nicely packed in a cover like this. Let me just take it out and show you. And here it is. Oh my god, just look at that color. Wow, this thing looks very beautiful. We'll just check out the phone in a moment. Let me also show you what else do we get in the box. And not to forget, as usual, you get an accessory box underneath the top cover. Don't forget to remove that. Over here, you've got a SIM card ejection tool. And inside the box, you get some paperwork. Along with that, you get a Samsung's bundle fast charger. It can give an output of 9 volts at 1.67 amps or 5 volts at 2 amps. So yes, the Galaxy M30s does support fast charging. And talking about the cable, you get a USB Type-C cable for charging and data transfer. Well, that's it. These were all the items you got in the box packing. Now let me finally show you the phone. So this is how Samsung's brand new Galaxy M30s looks like. Let me just remove this outer packaging on the top and show you how the phone looks like. Wow, I have to tell the color looks very beautiful. It's called the sapphire blue and has a kind of gradient finish from blue to green. Previously on the M30 we had a gradient finish from top to bottom while on this one it's got from left to right. I really like this new design. But going on the front it looks exactly same like the M30. It's got a 6.4 inch full HD plus super AMOLED display with the infinity U notch at the top. And over here you've got a 16 megapixel camera and a tiny earpiece just above that. Then that's it I guess there's nothing else on the front side. So let me just give you an overview on all the sides and show you what do we have on this phone. Going to the top there's a secondary noise cancelling microphone and on the left side you've got a sim card tray. This is a traditional type sim card slot guys it supports two nano sims and a micro SD card slot. And on the bottom side you've got a 3.5mm headphone jack, USB type C port, a microphone and a down firing single speaker. On the right side as usual you've got two buttons, one is a power button and above that you've got a volume rocker. The quality of the buttons are also good, they feel tactile and clicky. So that was our look at all the corners and this is how the phone looks from the back side. Let me just peel this sticker at the back and wow, I have to say this color looks absolutely gorgeous. I love this gradient blue to green finish, it's called the sapphire blue. Talking about the build quality, the build quality also looks decent. It actually looks pretty similar to the Galaxy M30. The body is entirely made of high quality plastic. Okay, so over here you've got the Samsung logo, a fingerprint scanner just about that. And at the top left you've got the camera setup. It's got a triple camera setup. The main one is a 48 megapixel primary camera. The second one is an 8 megapixel ultra wide angle camera. And the third one is a 5 megapixel camera for depth sensing. And beside that you've got a tiny single tone LED flash. 
and as i've already told you guys this m30s comes with a monster 6000 milliampere battery and yet the thickness of this phone is only around 8.9 mm that is awesome right and the phone is also not that heavy it just weighs only around like 188 grams in the hand talking about the comfort the phone feels grippy in the hand and offers decent comfort when you hold it all right then let's power on the phone and see if it's got some juice in it and by the time the phone boots up let's go through the specs of this phone the Galaxy M30s comes with a 6.4 inch Full HD Plus Super AMOLED Infinity U display. It's powered by Samsung's latest Exynos 9611, which is based on a 10 nanometer process. Talking about the variants, it comes in 4GB RAM as well as 6GB RAM. The one we have is a 6GB variant with 128 gigs of onboard storage. And the storage on it is also expandable up to 512GB using a micro SD card slot. Talking about the camera, it's got a new triple camera setup at the back. The primary one is a 48 megapixel camera. The secondary one is an 8 megapixel ultra wide angle camera. And the third one is a 5 megapixel camera for depth sensing. And on the front side, you've got a 16 megapixel front facing camera. Finally, coming to the battery, the Galaxy M30s comes with a monster 6000 milliampere battery. Well, those were all the specs of this phone. Now let's just continue with the video. So here it is guys, our new Galaxy M30s. The phone has booted up and I've also gone through the setup process. As you can see, the M30s also comes with an always on display. The always on display is completely customizable and as well as the phone has dynamic lock screen just like the other M series phone. Dynamic lock screen is a pretty good feature. The thing is whenever you power on the phone, you get a new different wallpaper based on your personalization from the settings. Okay, now it's time to test the fingerprint scanner. I've already set up the fingerprint scanner on the phone. So let's just unlock it and see how it performs. Okay, the fingerprint scanner was definitely accurate and working most of the time. But as you can see, it was not that fast. There was at least one to one and a half second of delay. And this is how the display of the Galaxy M30s looks like. It's got a beautiful 6.4 inch Full HD Plus Super AMOLED display with the Infinity U notch at the top. And I have to say the display looks absolutely beautiful from my first impressions. The bezels on this phone are very thin at the top as well as the sides. This thing has very high screen to body ratio. But as you can see, we've got some slight bezels on the bottom chin of the phone. And in terms of comparison with the previous Galaxy M30, it looks exactly the same from the front. I don't find any difference compared to that. Don't worry, I'll definitely be showing you side by side comparison with the M30 as well in this video. Alright then, as you can see, the UI looks pretty good. The phone runs on Android 9.0 OS and has the latest Samsung One UI 1.5. Let me open the settings and show you the software info. Let's go to about phone, software information and as you can see the android version is 9.0 and the one ui version is 1.5. Well that was about the about phone section. Now let's see how much storage is available on this phone out of the box. As I've told you earlier this is the 128 GB model and out of the box you get around like 1 or 8.6 GB of available space. Remaining all is occupied by the operating system and the pre-installed applications. Well that's it, that was our look at the settings app. The phone feels quite smooth, as you can see I didn't face any sort of lags or stutters anywhere. The UI is buttery smooth and yes the phone also comes with Dolby Atmos support but it works only on headphones, it doesn't function on the speaker. Ok so as I've told you, let me just bring my Galaxy M30 and compare it with the M30 side by side and show you how they look like. So as you can see, on the left we have the Galaxy M30s and on the right side we got the Galaxy M30. In terms of design, both the phones look very identical, except the camera layout at the back side. The M30s has a new camera layout, the flash is moved from the bottom and is placed to the right side of the top camera. Apart from that, everything else looks pretty similar, apart from the color. And as you can see, both the phones look very identical from the front side. It's very difficult to identify and say which one is M30 and which one is M30s if you look at both the phones from the front side. The major improvement you can see on the M30s compared to the Galaxy M30 is you're getting a huge improvement in the camera section, performance section as well as the battery side. On the previous M30, you had a 13 megapixel primary camera whereas on the new M30s you've got an upgrade over here, you've got a 48 megapixel primary camera. Talking about the CPU, you're coming from Exynos 7 series to Exynos 9611 powerful octa-core CPU and also the battery has been increased from 5000 to 6000 milliampere battery. And all these features and improvements you're getting for exactly or nearly the same price of the Galaxy M30. Let's open the camera app and show you how the interface looks like. 
The camera UI looks pretty similar to any other Samsung series phone. Talking about the modes, you've got all the modes on it, including the night mode, which was exclusively available on the premium Samsung category phones, and a lot of other camera modes, which include slow motion, super slow motion, and even hyperlapse. And one more great thing I'd like to mention is, this phone even has that new super steady mode. So by enabling this super steady shot, you're going to get very stabilized gimbal-like videos on this phone. That is awesome, right? So let's just shoot some pictures and see how the shutter lag is. Not bad, that was fast. And this is our very first picture shot on the Galaxy M30s. Well, this is not an in-depth review or camera review on this phone. It's just an unboxing and like a first impressions video. We'll talk about the camera quality, the picture and the video quality, all that in the full review video. Before I can make my full review video, I'll actually have to use this phone for some time. And after that, I'll be able to complete my full review. In the full review, we'll talk about the display quality. How is that new Xeno CPU performing? We'll talk about the gaming performance as well as the camera quality and the battery life. If you have any other requests also, do leave them in the comment section down below and I'll definitely try to cover them in my full review video. Well, that's it I guess, I'll end the video over here for today. I hope you all enjoyed this unboxing and first impressions video on the Samsung's brand new Galaxy M30s Sapphire Blue Edition. If you all like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more new awesome videos. And I'll see you all in my next video.